right, so I'm here with Abby. Abby, what's the name of your company? Pop Fizz Clink Events. And what what do you do? What is your company about? Yeah, so what we do is we work with brides and grooms and their families to make their vision for their wedding day come to life. So they're not worrying about all the details leading up to the wedding and the day of. So who are you working with today and where are we at? With Audrey and Heath today and we're at Abernathy Center here in Oregon City. Um, and we've been working with Audrey and Heath over the last year to really, you know, see what their vision was, what did they want to make their day special, unique, and personalized, and we help them make that come to life. Normally I deal with the bride and groom, but you guys found me. And where'd you guys find me, and how'd you guys decide, like, you want me to be part of your day? Yeah, totally. So um, we're newer to the Oregon market, but just through word of mouth and research online, and we really just were looking for a personality that fits well with with Heath and I. How important is it to have a DJ for somebody's wedding versus a band or somebody just doing it themselves? Yeah, a DJ is, we always say a DJ is so much more than just someone playing music. Um, they're keeping, you know, your reception going, they're engaging with the crowd, and they're making your reception a memorable event. This location is indicative of everything that, that Heath and Audrey are as a couple, everything that they love about the Pacific Northwest. The greenery, the tranquility, and the embracing the outdoors. To all of the guests here, they're happy to share this moment with you. They've known most of you for many, many years, either through school or growing up with one another or through work. Music is obviously the first thing that comes to mind, but my main focus is being the master of ceremony, making sure that when I say something, everybody knows what's going on, so everybody has clear, detailed directions of what's going to be happening next. Totally. So if we didn't have uh, proper speakers, this is a pretty big room, and I want to make sure everybody hears everything. It's not too loud, not too quiet. How does it help having sound throughout the room um, that you've seen at past weddings? It's huge. I mean, there's nothing worse when, you know, Aunt Susie's in the back corner and she can't hear the toast. Um, so I think that's awesome that, that you really take that, that into account. Yeah, that's my, I mean, the music is great, but if people don't hear what I'm saying, people can get lost, people are not ready. Exactly. And I like to make sure, you know, our photographers and all other vendors are kind of on the same page yeah. when it comes to this wedding. What separates you apart? What makes yes. you so important to the success of somebody's wedding? Yeah, we treat every wedding like it's someone in our own family. So we don't want the bride or the mom of the bride or Aunt Susie to be the ones decorating the tables or coordinating with the DJ right. and making sure that everything's going right. They should be enjoying their time together and really soaking in that moment. And so to us, we take that very seriously and that's what we love about it. There's just one more thing I want to make sure that I'm extreme about, um, which is going to be the love that I have for Audrey. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to keep this as close as I can. Um, thank you for being my rock, my voice of reason, and my personal coach and cheerleader when I need you most.